Hello folks, welcome back to the channel. This is me from Anvil Extreme. Here we are going to look at when is the best time to harvest corn to make chaff in Farm Simulator 22. If this you're looking for, then please stay tuned. I said in the intro is to be a short video on when is the best time to harvest chaff in Farm Simulator 22. And to do this, we've got some corn here, and we're going to harvest this with chaff. Obviously, unlike with your normal grain crops with a normal harvester, you would have to wait until the growth state is at ready to harvest, or the dark, sort of darkish, lightish orange. However, with forage, you can harvest early. So, if we go to the help menu over here, and if we go to chaff and silage, and it says chaff is made of chopping up crops or picking up windrows using a forage harvester and a suitable header. You cut down corn, wheat, barley, grass, sunflower, soybeans, oats, or canola, even if they're not fully grown. So, what's in there? early growth state they can potentially be harvested so potentially this could mean a higher yield a lower yield my thinking of course it's going to be it's going to be a lower yield however if you're running seasons especially like six ten day seasons or more or less that can really make a difference so this is growth state number one of the corn and what we're going to do we're going to simply unfold this unfold the header and we're going to see if we can harvest the corn when it is in growth state number two because growth state one is when it's just planted there it is turn the forage harvester on can we harvest this no we cannot so we can't harvest it when it's at growth state number two what about growth state number three Let's go and find out, folks. Grows again. And see if we can harvest this, which I don't think we can, but you never know. So we'll get us on ready. And then we'll wait for it to grow again. There it is. Can we harvest at growth state number three? The answer is no, you cannot. So we can't harvest out any the early growth states, so what about the next growth state? Again, let's go and find out folks. Growth state actually, when you first plant it, it is actually at growth state zero as I would describe it. When it starts to sprout, that is one, then two, and then so on. So January was zero, February was one, March was two. And here are in April, this is growth state number three. So can we harvest it at growth state number three? And the answer is no. So what about growth state number four? Here are folks on the penultimate growth state, which is number five. And we know we can harvest it last time, which actually we ended up with 15,656 litres. So let's see how much we get if we waited for one more growth state. In theory, we should get more. So we're going in a straight line, not steering at all. Yes, it's perhaps not an hour, hour straight, so there may be some neck. Next, sorry, negligible results, but in general, the result should remain valid still. So, as you can see, we dumped a little pile over there. So, that side we was at 15,656. And how much are we going to get for waiting another growth state? Can we actually hit 15,000? I wonder.
just going to let it process through. I'm going to turn it off. So yep, yeah, that's all of it, and we've got what was it fifteen thousand five hundred and seventy-four, and that is a difference of actually that's less crop we got. Last time we got six five six, this time we got five seven four. Again, next ball because obviously it's not in our straight line. So my conclusion. It is there's no difference between growth state number four and growth state number five. Obviously, this is still growing. It's technically not ready to harvest. So, if we wait until tomorrow, we should see better yieldage. I think so. Yeah. Let's go and fast forward and let's do this again, folks. Still ready to harvest state. So it's gone from dark green to orange, so in theory we should get the most yieldage from this, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna turn this on. Make sure it's lowered, make sure we're straight, cruise control on, and I'm not gonna touch the steering. Apart from the tweak at start, we'll just get it straight. So I'm not gonna touch touch this and so in theory we should get the same amount of results, if not more than what we had on the previous growth states of 4 and 5. And already about halfway through and I think we've got more crop. As we're here in 10,000, 11, 12, maybe a bit more now but not by much I don't think. 13. 14, 15,000. So that is 15,539. And that is. Yeah, so checking. Yeah. That is a very unusual result because again, 15,539 is lower than either of the previous growth states so my take of this is don't wait until it's ready to harvest if you can harvest this as chaff if you harvest it at growth state 4, 5 or 6 this may be a bit different for other crops like sunflower, wheat, oats and that but for corn which is your typical May silage material there is the negligible difference and what I'll do, I'll put a table up and at the end of this and I'll show you folks what I've got and pretty much just show you a more of a visual standpoint. But yep, yeah, so that's going to be it for me today. I hope you've enjoyed this and found this helpful and informative in some way, shape or form. If so, smash that button. Feel free to comment below. If you want to share with them, please be my guest. If you're not sure to try yet, then please consider. But, where choose to do. Hope everyone has a nice day. But for now, this is me Farmer Envoy Extreme, and I'll see you all very soon.